Facebook. Hello, Facebook. Hey, Outlander fans. Leanne Aguilera here with Entertainment Tonight, and I'm here with two of your favorite stars of all time, the amazing Katrina Bell and Sam Hewen, the stars of Outlander. We are gearing up for season two. We're gearing up for the Globes, and we just want to take a little second and get to know you guys out there. Send us your fan questions, and we will get started. Apparently, you already are, so thank you so much. Uh, while we wait for those comments to come in, guys, I just want to pitch it off to you. What is your favorite thing about Outlander fans? Ooh, what is your favorite thing about Outlander fans? I think it's just how passionate they are. Yes, I mean, already we've had people... Ding. This <laughs> is them. They make, they make a nice little <laughs> group every time they talk. Exactly. Yes. They're, they're, very, they're very active, aren't they? Mm -hmm. and, uh, and involved in everything we do. And just their generosity actually is huge. I mean, they, they've been huge supporters of Sam's charity and my charity, and, and that, I think, is, is the thing that holds us with the most. Mm. All right, and our first Facebook Q&A photo or uh, question is going to be from Lisa Sherrod, and she says, Sam and Katrina, how was it to learn how to ride horses from scratch for the series? Not from scratch. No. I think both of our CVs said that we could ride horses before. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Amongst other things. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, we, I remember the first day seeing you and your, your riding helmet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I think I looked... Um, I, I looked like a real pro that yeah. day, right? <laughs> I, I just tried to get off the horse without falling off, and I don't think I, I succeeded. But uh, yeah, it's definitely it's a great part of the job, and we both enjoy it. And uh, there's always a competition between us. Oh, really? How yeah. So? Well, we now, I mean, last year I had, had kind of like a, a tank, but a slow, fat tank. Si. Um, <clears throat> and this year I have a Ferrari horse, uh, Pro Protus, who's... Um, who likes to race Sam Sleepy, so... However, Katrina doesn't realise that I've ridden her tank this year and realised that he's not actually a tank, he's a wonderful horse. And, uh, I know it's, Travis is wonderful. He's, he's brilliant, <laughs> so uh, I think I'm better on her horse. Um, okay, so Gretchen Landis wants to know, Hi, how often do you guys get annoyed with each other? <laughs> well, I'm going to say very rarely. <laughs> Wow. Never. Okay. Never, right? Never. How could you? I mean, she's amazing. No. I mean, how could you? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay. This? I'll remember this. <laughs> uh, I don't think we've ever fought now. No, we... we yeah, have you ever fought? No, I, 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 I do remember one, yeah, time. I do remember one time I was, I was sort of taking the piss of your pronunciation of French and you got a bit annoyed at me. <laughs> But that was just because I deserved it. And then, yeah. And then what? Well, then you say potatoes. And <laughs> just, you know. Instead of... Potatoes. <laughs> um, okay, so Wanda Serrano <laughs> wants to know, who or what do you miss most when you are on a break from shooting Outlander? Um... I, I, like we miss each other. I mean, I'm, I miss Sam when we're not there. We miss old Mary Mingus as well, don't we? Um, do. Sorry, Tobias Menzies. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, it's we have like we have such a great crew, and you know, I think all of us we sort of get along very well. So when the Highlanders weren't there, like for the first few apps this season, you know, it, we missed them, and when they came back, it was like a it was like a big reunion. It was great yeah, fun. Uh, up. Yes, exactly. Oh, wow. <laughs> you guys are sending them in really fast right now. Um, Stephanie Peck Chang wants to know, what did you think of THE, in all caps, red dress in the upcoming season? Uh, I'll let him answer that. I don't think I had seen it. Had I seen it before? Oh, well, I'd, I'd seen the red dress walking down the corridor, but um, yeah, it's remarkable. I mean. To dress Katrina is it's not difficult. She looks great in, in virtually everything. Um, but this, the red dress is, is incredible, and uh, it, it is quite a masterpiece, isn't it? It's, <laughs> I mean, it takes some getting used to, I'm sure, to, to wear it. I, I think I'd look terrible in it, to be honest. Uh, I, no, I, I think you should not sell yourself short. I think you would look spectacular in it. Yeah. It would accentuate your hips nicely. <laughs> riding, yeah. riding the horse. <laughs> well, going off of that, uh, Rena McCain wants to know, just saw that Terry was nominated uh, for costuming. What is your favorite costume that you've ever been in? Ooh. Oh, I don't know. There's a couple. 
Um, well, one of my favorites from season one was the green and sort of navy tartan dress that's actually in the sort of second half of the season posters. Mm -hmm. I, I, was, I loved that. Um, but this season, there is a there is one that we call the dressage, um, which is this beautiful sort of green fabric with loads of embroidery and then like a mustard underlayer skirt, and it's just it, it's stunning. It's really beautiful. Um, I think they just released a picture of it like last week, but it's really beautiful. Yeah, I that one. It's, I've got a straw <laughs> hat with flowers. Mm -hmm. yeah. What's your, favorite, what's your favorite <laughs> costume that you've worn? Kilt. Darling. Kilt. <laughs> Kilt. Kilt. Kilt all the time. Kilt, it's easy. <laughs> uh, Lily Isrenal was really sweet. She said, hello from France. I'm supposed Bonjour. to be asleep right now since it's 1 a.m. here. Bonne nuit. <laughs> but I was wondering if you both could say something in French just as to check and see how you guys are going to be in season two. Why not I do the mouth and you say the words? Qu'est-ce que vous dire? Uh, bon soirée, j'espère que tu uh, um, ah, j'espère que, que tu enjoy uh, season 2. <laughs> it's terrible. <laughs> anyway, it's gonna be great, I promise. <laughs> I thought it was you can, you can read the subtitles. <laughs> Uh, Claire, sorry, Guillaume. <laughs> Our French tutor who is just crying yeah, right he's now. He's just uh, probably hung himself. <laughs> uh, well, we've got another Claire out there who wants to ask you guys a question. Claire Wilchar wants to know if you could go back in time to any era, what would you choose? Where would you go? Um, you've been asked this question a lot. <clears throat> um, I always say I want to go in the future. But maybe I have to make a decision. Um, I mean, I've always been obsessed with uh, sort of Camelot and things like that. I know that wasn't really a period, but yeah, maybe somewhere around there, King okay. Arthur's period. Okay. I was switching it up today too. Are you? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. I Careful. I think I would like to just to see like the land of the pharaohs in its in its height and <laughs> and bathe in milk. Yeah. I think Cleopatra. I would make a great Cleopatra. Yeah, you would. You would. She so, would. Wouldn't you? Yeah. They could remake the movie Cleopatra. Would, would you want to be uh, Richard Burton? Isn't that isn't it? No? Is it Richard Burton? You could be a pharaoh. Yeah. I, I would be a pharaoh, yeah. Right. Ready Sing. pharaoh? We know what we're doing. I'm <laughs> listening. Uh, wants to know, what are the best and worst things about working together? To be honest, there are no worse things, are there? <laughs> I mean, the best thing... Regina has the best snacks. <laughs> what kind and of snacks? <laughs> she has great snacks. Uh, in fact, so much that I've started eating the same food as Regina because it's really Yeah, because really he started getting jealous. Yeah, I did. I mean, um, she'd offer me one and I'd eat more. Um, <laughs> or sometimes you just take it. <laughs> if it was sitting in the green room, I'd just come back hungry and, and it'd be all gone. Yep. Yeah. The um, the worst, well, well the worst the is probably actually days when we both get in the same childish mood and we constantly just make each other giggle through uh, takes, that's... And then no work gets done. Yeah. Yes, and then and then people <clears throat> get angry at well, us. Yeah, everyone gets very upset, don't they? Yeah. Focus! Yeah. <laughs> well, how do you snap out of the giggles when you guys got them? It's usually when someone gets to the point where you can see they're actually about to get really angry. <laughs> You're yeah. like, okay, gotta it's bring raining this in. and people are wanting, mm -hmm. tired and want to go. Home. Uh, well, this is actually a Twitter question, and it says, "Congratulations, you guys just won a People's Choice Award last Yay. night." Thank you. What does that mean to you? Since we didn't get an acceptance speech, and who will take the award home? <clears throat> Um, what does that mean to us? Well, first of all, thank you very much. Um, we know that the fans were so busy voting and that means a huge amount to us. But what it means is that we all work so hard and the fact that you guys enjoy what we do and have given you, that means everything. And probably Ron will take it home, don't you think? We could maybe steal it off, Ron. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, Sam, good interviewing skills right there. Hey, I think I've got a job now. Yeah, yeah. definitely. You definitely have a backup plan if the Speaking whole like, awesome actor can work out. 
Uh, what is your all-time favorite line from Outlander? Stop help, he's going over. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, my all-time favorite. That's Ira's favorite. Yeah. Um, oh, uh, mine is um, when Ian offers to <laughs> come help find Jamie and I, uh, Claire turns around to him and says, but you haven't got a leg. <laughs> That's one of my favorites. I think Dougal's got a lot of great lines. Mostly about grinding corn. Oh, oh yeah. gosh. I think he always, he's always just so direct and I, I like that. <laughs> uh, does anyone play pranks on set? And if so, who's the best prankster? No, no one plays No one does that. actually. No. no? We're really very boring. boring. Yeah, very, yeah. You guys need to start playing some pranks. Pranks. That's for children. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to keep up. Because if nothing, we are the bastions of maturity. <laughs> we are very yes. mature. Yes. <laughs> what quality do you guys most admire about each other? Sam's maturity. <laughs> yeah. I'll be mature here. Um, uh, I like Katrina's sense of humor and her... Uh, I admire her resilience as well. <clears throat> Thank you, darling. It's very nice. I, I admire Sam's big heartedness. <laughs> uh, Sam, have you ever been injured on set while doing your own stunts? Um, have I ever been injured? On no, I haven't. No, I've never been injured. I was looking for some wood There's to touch. Some... <laughs> uh, <laughs> I've never been injured on set. I'm doing any stunts? Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> well, keeps well, it's it's your knee on set. How yeah, I've been just cat a lot, a lot on set. Yeah, I think I've dropped you. I've hit it you on the head. Dropped me, hit me on the head with your sword a lot. With my, yeah, <laughs> I've yeah, I've done all kinds of. Um. Okay. Wow, you guys are sending in so many of them right now. Uh, Hannah Jones wants to know what is the best thing about Scotland, and she loves the show with. Five emojis. Five, five emojis. What kind? All the same ones. They're all the same ones. They're the really. Which one is it? It's really, really excited that her, the eyes oh. are closed. Oh, is right that there. what that means? Yeah. I never quite understood what that one meant. Mm -hmm. Ah, I see. Like yeah. I also learned what this this one is used a lot in in Thailand. What does that mean? Thank you. Thank you. Cotton crab. There you go. Uh, Saudi crab. To anyone in Thailand. Uh, there you oh go. my gosh. So, uh, multilingual. <laughs> um, what was the question? What was the question? <laughs> um, it, it was, what, what's your favourite thing about Scotland? Favourite thing about Scotland is... So... Landscape. Yeah, it's so beautiful. That's about it. There's got to be more. That place is absolutely gorgeous. You've got to be going places all the time. I think that thing was your favourite thing about Scotland. Okay. Yeah, if right. you want five, if there are five emojis, you've got five things. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the landscape, the people, Yes. Um, um, the music. The culture. Oh, that's yeah. Culture. Mm -hmm. Culture. Um, um, the humor. The humor. And uh, unfortunately, the whiskey. Oh, yeah. yeah. That yeah. was very exciting. <laughs> I was very excited yeah. about that one. <laughs> that actually reminds me of a Twitter question that we got earlier today. Who holds their liquor better, Sam or Katrina? Um, I think the question to ask is who probably drinks more of the liquor in a single session, and that uh, would probably be Katrina. Uh, but she... who stands the most stable at the end of the night? That would probably be Sam. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Jessica Schmessica says, love the show, binged watched it over the holidays. What other television shows do you both enjoy? Oh, well, oh, I'm watching The Making of a Murderer right oh, now, right. which is what so good. are you on? I'm only on three. Stop. Okay. But, yeah. Um, Don't talk. And, but, oh, I'm in love with this show called Catastrophe, and it also has Tobias Menzies in it, just randomly, but it's such a fantastic show. I'm transparent. Ooh, yeah. Ah, oh, Mr. Robot. Oh, yeah, that's a good that's one, a good one. Too. Loving it. That's a really good so one. So yeah. good. Yeah. Uh, Olga Rocky wants to know, uh, Katrina, how was it dealing with the baby bump and your costumes this year? Um, I loved getting to wear the baby bump. Um, it was 
we didn't actually wear it with the costumes for a lot, um, but it was it was great. Sam thought it was a, a basketball and, and something to be punched um, occasionally. Uh, <laughs> uh, shit. I, it was more of a poke. <laughs> he, he, yeah, you, you had great fun with it. Um, no, it was, look, it was, I loved the storyline. I absolutely relished being able to play that. And, you know, for Claire to go through all of that, it was, it was great. Um, and yeah, I mean, you know, it's great. Pregnancy is, is a beautiful thing and it was great mm. to explore that. Amazing. Well, unfortunately, you guys, that is all the time that we have right now. So keep it locked to ET Online because we're going to have even more Outlander content. And thank you so much for thank joining us and joining me. I really appreciate it. Thank you, everyone. Bye.